Hello and welcome to another Marvelous Pops video. Today I have for you more Funko Pops from the Office series. So with that being said, let's get started. Now for the first two items I have for you, they're not Funko Pops, but they're like the pop brand and it's um, Hot Topic just got some in this morning and it was Black Friday so it had like a buy one get one half off. And I'm talking about the Office Pop Pezzes. And what's cool about this one is it's Prison Mike like with like with bandana so if you didn't have a chance to get the exclusive um i guess this is the way you could have it which is but another thing is um i'm surprised they put like a exclusive sticker on it since the pop itself is exclusive to them i don't know and then the book face gym one which is pretty simple it's just jim with book on his face written on his face um this one again they could have made a common one and put the chase sticker on this one and upped the value by a lot and sold it for a lot more, but I guess not. And they both come with just like a random, like assorted fruit candy, whatever. And now for the actual pops, I'll get the uh, commons first. The first one I have for you is the White Troops Belschnickel. This one's really cool because it shows like all the detail from like the leaves and uh, sticks, even like the whip. Like, if you can see right here. Like, it even has all the whip. And it actually has some weight because of the head of it. Like, his hat has a bunch on it. It's pretty cool. The next one I have for you is another Dwight one. And it is Dwight Troot as Elf. Now, this one, again, is pretty simple. But it, like, it, like, has a bunch of detail. It has the, uh... What Michael gave him for his Secret Santa, I believe, gift. And Dwight was trying to put it together. And this was the point he thought it was like a gun or a blaster or whatever. And so he's putting it together like that before he realized it was like a nutcracker. And this one actually had to be lowered in the box because of the height of the um, elf uh, hat. Yeah, and even has like the pointed ears and all that. It's pretty cool. The next one I have for you is a classic, I'd have to say, to me at least. Michael Scott as Classy Santa. This one's from the episode where Holly came back and he was trying to impress her. The only thing I would say on this one is, like, my the one I got has, like, a sort of film type... I don't know, it's, like, something on the arm. You can't really see it, but... It just bugs me a little because if you uh, if you like to collect, you want to make sure the pops are in good condition. But the box is in pretty good condition too, and it's just basically him in a red Santa suit minus the beard. And now for the exclusives, I'll start off with um, a Target exclusive, and for this one I have the Dwight Schrute, the blonde edition. It's like it came in a pop T-shirt, I believe. And the only difference between this one and the common one is he, this one has his hair blonde. And that's from the episode where Jim and Pam, like, convinced him to dye his hair blonde because I think they tricked him to thinking he was in the FBI or CIA, I think. And he's covered and blown, so he had to dye his hair. Which, pretty cool. Nothing really, um, nothing really too special about that one. It was just an exclusive. So, now the one that I really liked from Target is the Golden Face Gym. Now, this one was hard to get, actually, because I kept looking at Target every time to see if they had it, and they didn't have it. And the one day they had it, I got it, like, a couple, like, two months ago, I think. And it was on a holiday, so luckily everybody was gone, and people who were looking for it weren't there. And it's pretty cool. It's like the gold on his face has like a glittery uh, thing to it, which is really cool. Because this character, like his character, Golden Face from the uh, Threat Level Midnight episode, was so like good that yeah, it was pretty cool. And then the next one I have for you is Andy Bernard. This one again was a Target exclusive. It came in usually like the same time as the Golden Face one. It's cool, but probably could have been 
uh, just a common because it's not like a, another variation of the characters which I kind of like how they're doing all the characters and then the exclusives are different variations of it which also sometimes if people who ever like like Andy better it'll be harder for them to get this one since it's an exclusive and if it was a common and they just wanted to get one certain of it like just one kind it'd be easier but let me take this out of a protector I put in the only thing is what I didn't see when I actually got it was it had some damage so like right here on the corner right there like right here it's bent all like right here you could probably crease like iron that out and then sort of down here like right here it's creased again bent right here but in the front of it it's good the next one I have I actually picked this one up last week I believe because I was in Fresno and this store happened to be there which was cool and that is the date mic and it, it was exclusive to calendars go which is really weird for them to have exclusives because I don't think they've really done any they've done like a few exclusives but for like a popular series like this I'm surprised they gave it to a store like that and this one it has his like the logo I think it's a bunny and then it's just him holding the pool cue from when he went on a double date with uh, Jim and Pam and whoever he ended up taking out. Yeah. And the sticker is just basically generic, which is... Because all the other ones have sort of a different shape, and this one's just like a square. And nothing really cool to it. Yeah. And, yeah, it's the final one. The final one I have for you is actually... It's not an exclusive, but... It is harder to find, unless you're, like, really lucky. And that is the Jim Halpert Chase. And now this one, I actually had to get online, because I waited in line at Hot Topic to get it, but it they only had two of them, so they sold out, and I had to get it on Amazon. But it did come in a protector, which is really good, like, good, because it actually is a pretty good protector, too. It's not like the flimsy protectors. But... Yeah, all it is again is here. I can get the. It's basically so this, but like this, and it's the just the common. I mean, it's just a small detail with book written on his face, but still really cool. And also, I think it's worth like thirty three bucks. So if you ever have this one, you bought it for like cheap, then you could resell it for like double the price, which is good. Um, that is all I have for you today, and remember to like and subscribe and click the notification bell for more upcoming videos. Bye.